Well, overall, my job is to coordinate and, and manage the entire education delivery program. Um, that uh, takes in three strands effectively. It's the uh, school's expansions, it's the major maintenance, uh, and then it's the strategy development for the delivery of those. The London Borough of Croydon is, is really rather unique in as much as it's the most affected local authority in the country, not just in London but in the country, in terms of its need to expand its education estate. I could recommend Wilmot Dixon without any hesitation. I've worked with Wilmot Dixon in the London Borough of Bexley and in the London Borough of Croydon. Uh, using SCAPE, using the Academy's framework uh, and also just using traditional uh, tendering processes. In, in total we've been involved with 13 schools now and the last of those schools are going to actually be handed over in September 17 so it's been a long programme of work and one that we hope will continue. It's been a really valued relationship to us and one that we've taken you know, very, very seriously as a business. As we do with all our, all our clients, we like to make sure they're happy, they're pleased and we give them um, the jobs that they thought they were going to get leads to repeat work as you can see from you know, what I just described at Croydon. I think we all want to understand Croydon's priorities, strategic priorities, in delivering educational places very well. They understand the time pressures we're under and the programme that we have to deliver these projects. I think particularly also when they do go down to site to start to build the projects, their site teams, I think, are very professional and manage the delivery of the project exceptionally well. For any school project, I would say to the head teacher, get involved early before a planning group of one type or another is presenting you with something as a fait accompli and saying that's what you're having. That didn't happen in this case. You know, we were in very early and as a result of that we got what, what we wanted. The duration was extremely quick, which is one of the great advantages of this particular system. And in the September when the school opened, uh, this site, Brigstock Manor site, was one of the only schools in Croydon that opened on time. So that was a feather in our cap as well, which we were very pleased about. Croydon there were two real key benefits. One was the procurement route that um, they chose, which was through the SCAPE framework, which we're the lead contractor with. Um, that brought really speed from the start of the project to taking it onto site. Um, you know, SCAPE has demonstrated that you save up to 200 days in the procurement process in pre-construction up to the point of delivery, which you know, when Croydon were looking to have in schools um, onto their site was absolutely important. And the other is the product that we developed. We use the Sinesis Dewey model for a lot of our schools with Croydon. The first four were, were based on the Dewey model. And those are a pre-designed product. But what's great about them is they're actually flexible, so you can extend them both horizontally and vertically. So we managed to get that product in on each of the sites by either squeezing it, expanding it, lifting it up a level. <laughs> experience this you know it's it's kind of a once in a, a career lifetime isn't it that you get to do something like this and kind of you know you can think back and you know 20 30 years from now this score still be standing you can think I helped put my print on my, my print on that building 
You know, it's, it's you know what a, a marvelous thing to be involved in. Originally, Croydon came to us and they offered us two schools, two 1FE schools from a batch of four. Partway through our process, using the Sinesis project, they realised how fast our process was. They were facing challenges on the next two schools, a 2FE and a 3FE. They approached us and said, could we help them out? Uh, we did that and we worked with them to deliver them to the timescales that worked for the end users. Moving to another Oasis school at the end of this term, um, which Wilmot Dixon have just refurbed the school, and so kind of again, I'm, I'm, I'm in there with, the, with actually the same people that were here, which is great. And obviously, we're building a new secondary school as well, Oasis Arena, and it, again, it's the same group of people, which is great. So we're getting to know, you know, the team really well. You know, if there are defects, etc. You know, we can have those conversations, we know where to find people, it's the same people and kind of, so it makes the communication really good. We have such a good relationship with Croydon um, that they trust us to deal with their end users um, together with, with their employees agent without them having to be present. And we've got a good report in communication stream back to the client after that. But also we have a very good relationship with their consultants. They have a, a, a set of key consultants they use for all the projects. And we've got very good relationships with their employees agents and their professional consultants. Players. Wilmot Dixon and bring their key suppliers to the table right at the beginning of that process, you know, the architects, the engineers. It's the full service there, it's not just the, a, a contractor, it is the full design service that comes with it, effectively a multidisciplinary service. But you've got the added advantage of the contractor's input at that early stage on buildability, on risk and all the, the things that you need to understand as early on in the project as possible. The speed at which they got to the point of understanding whether a project was doable and getting that reassurance on the cost at a very early stage from a contractor and then being able to identify all the, the key issues around the project and, and risks and you're getting that advice effectively for free. My experience with Wilmots is that they are a good contractor and they're very strong on health and safety as well and the whole site organisation. When you achieve the projects and the timescales they've achieved without any problems with health and safety, that's a big plus. Um, any accident on a site is a no-no, any problems or interface with the school is a no-no and it's managing everything together to make sure that the project is completed. Wilmot Dixon were a really good company to work with. They were able to work with us and with our staff here and with my site manager to make sure that we've got a building now that we're really happy with, that children do really effective learning in. Yes, you obviously have to go through your normal governance processes to make sure that you have um, got a, a, a sort of the, the best solution for your delivery um, but if Wilmot Dixon sort of a, the chosen company through that procurement process then I would have no hesitation in recommending it. <laughs>